completely kaput. Always remember to wear your helmets, kids. It gave up the ghost. Years of decay made this pipe brittle. It's almost coming off the wall. This valve is missing its rotary handle. Maybe I can swing over. I've heard that cave fishing is a thing, but I'm really not in the mood right now. That's a pretty deep drop. I can't even see the floor from here. Can anybody hear me? Always remember to wear your helmets, kids. Good thing there's no monkey wrench involved in this puzzle. There you go. Water, march. Years of decay made this pipe brittle. It's almost coming off the wall. Maybe I can swing over. This pickaxe is probably the only tool around here that could be useful to me. Interesting rock formation. It doesn't look too solid. Help!
I wish this wishing thing would actually work. I've heard that cave fishing is a... I knew I shouldn't have skipped Aunt Lottie's swimming lessons. Maybe I can swing over. with it. Oh, you finally I made it! I almost thought it. you'd never come. Look at you, covered in dirt. Did you stumble all the way here through the old mines? Uh, I don't have to answer that. Anyway, you're not going to believe what just happened to me. Yeah, I guess you're right. You gotta tell me every single detail when we have the time. They sure have big doors around here. It looks like they really wanted to make sure there was no trespassing. I've been thinking, what if it wasn't meant to keep someone out, but to keep something in? Let's find out. We need to get that door open. Beverly, for a moment I thought I was a goner. Now that I've been able to escape this compromising situation, Gretchen and I are standing in front of a gigantic steel gate. I'll get back to you with more details. Please light up these symbols. Wow, these look like Neolithic cave paintings. Who would have guessed? A group of stickmen fallen asleep around some sort of hexagon. Tenhauser, this is sensational. Fallen asleep? Look, this seems to have activated one of the lights on the vault door. You see that afterglow? What's that over there? Only a flock of bats. Or is it a swarm? A herd? A gaggle?
Did you actually rappel down? Of course. How else? Any ideas? What's that over there? Interesting. Are you thinking what I am thinking? Is this a graffito? Down here. In any case, it's hard to decipher. Are you seeing that hexagon there as well? No idea. You've got the door open already? Interesting. Maybe these inscriptions are somehow connected to the opening mechanism. Some sort of photonic reception, perhaps. What's that over there? Just a crack in the wall. Could you point the light in this direction? Just a shadow. What do you make of this? Weird. Tenhauser, these are ancient Egyptian hieroglyphs. What are they doing here? I'm afraid I don't know too much about them. This pictogram on the left could mean door or gateway. It's followed by the symbol of death. Doesn't that spark your curiosity as well? Did you notice that other little light turning on? I don't get it. Open What's sesame! You're not going to believe this. These are Germanic runes, my special field of interest. Huh, this one roughly translates to... <clears throat> Be gone, stranger. For all you may find here is certain death. There, another light. Can we take a look at the graffito again? Now there are five lights. What does it mean? Maybe this is some kind of activation device. Again. Can I get a light here? No, nothing. Please point the light to the hieroglyphs again.
Could you light up the cave paintings for me again? Could you show me that ruin thing again? Can we take a look at the graffito again? Wow. Congratulations. I think you found your ritual site. What do you think? Why is this place all covered in scribblings? This is puzzling. All of these characters are in different languages. It's impossible to tell from down here whether they were written in different eras as well. I was abducted, imprisoned, and scrutinized by a mad scientist, among other things. You must have bumped your head too hard. No, no. For real. There is an old sanitarium down this valley. I thought no one's lived there in ages. There's at least one so-called scientist. He conducted a wide range of crazy tests on me. Tests? Yes, he had me talk about colors and answer personal questions. Tenhauser, are you sure you haven't suffered some sort of brain damage? How do I know? I found your camp outside. Yes, I waited for you. But since it took you so long, I couldn't resist going ahead. Enough talk. Let's find a way to open this monstrous gate. What do you think? Who'd build such a thing? No idea. Definitely not my proto-Germans. I'm still wondering who built this, and why. Exciting. These must be the thrills they advertised. Again. Could you point the light in this direction? Ah, interesting. This looks like a Latin inscription. Hang on to your head. Interpreted freely, this translates to Path of No Return. <laughs> Hogwash, you Romans.
again. Could you light up the cave paintings for me again? Please point the light to the hieroglyphs again. Could you show me that ruin thing again? Please show me the Latin inscriptions again. Can we take a look at the graffito again? Again, five lights. Again. Can we take a look at the graffito again? Please show me the Latin inscriptions again. Could you show me that ruin thing again? Please point the light to the hieroglyphs again. Could you light up the cave paintings for me again? Again, five lights. Again.
Could you light up the cave paintings for me again? Please point the light to the hieroglyphs again. Please show me the Latin inscriptions again. Could you show me that ruin thing again? Can we take a look at the graffito again? Again, five lights. This looks promising. This cave has obviously been visited by explorers for millennia. Isn't it strange that all of them left warnings on the wall? And whoever built this gigantic vault wanted to make sure that only a human with the right set of knowledge could open it. Maybe long after its architects ceased to exist. I assume this is why they utilized all of these different writings. They literally left the coat on the wall. In case of an emergency? Remarkable. Yes!
Let me find the lights. Any idea? I wonder who or what's behind all of this. Did you see that pretty large particle accelerator? Wow. What an enormous compound. All sorts of strange gadgetry. Any idea? I wonder who or what's behind all of this. All this modern hardware must have cost a fortune. We didn't even have anything remotely this size at my university. No idea what purpose they might serve. Come too close to this killing machine. Hmm. Something is wrong with the engine powering the solar system. As if the universe was out of balance. I stumbled upon an impressive model of our solar system, yet curiously, it displays our nine planets in disorder as if there was a disturbance in the interstellar balance. Much like an event known to the ancient Greeks as ekpyrosis, the catastrophic imbalance of the universe. Whether this is a foreshadowing of things to come, or the device is simply broken, I cannot say. To be honest, it's hard to say if it means anything at all. seems to be defective. An opening mechanism. Of course, the door is blocked. Error. Memory overflow. Hello? Anybody there? Of course. Another locked door. Error. Memory overflow. Error. Memory overflow. I wonder who or what's be I brought back order to the universe. I brought back Error. order to the universe. Memory overflow. Error. 
I've already made an entry on this. I stumbled upon an impressive yet cute much, whether this is to be honest. Errol, memory overflow. Could you please turn off that noise? Memory overflow. Of course. The door is blocked. Errol. Memory overflow. Of course. The door is blocked. Errol. Memory overflow. It seems to be defective. Errol, memory overflow. Errol, memory overflow. Could you please turn off that noise? 64 kilobytes of main memory on isolinear chips? Good lord. Gretchen, this is the future. Error. Memory overflow. Error. Memory overflow. Seems you have a RAM module loose. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Please identify yourself. My name is Tannhauser. Hans Tannhauser. I do not recognize you, Hans. Why does it matter? I am only allowed to grant access to authorized personnel. I'm Hans, and I defragmented your memory. I do not recognize you, Hans. I am only allowed to grant access to authorized personnel. This isn't going anywhere, Tannhauser. We need brute force. Seems to be defective. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Please identify yourself. I can't see you. Who's talking there? My name is Barbarossa 2000. I am the guardian of the station. Can't you just open this door for me? Not possible. This isn't going anywhere, Tannhauser. We need brute force. What kind of station is this? This station was built by the Millennium Cooperative. I may only give this information to authorized individuals. How do I become authorized? Not possible. I cannot authorize you, since I do not know you. Who constructed you? I was developed and built by Dr. Von Strack and Dr. Rumler. I am property of the Millennium Cooperative.
It's me, Dr. Von Streck. Negative. Your voice patterns don't match Dr. Von Streck's. I'm telling you, these things are of no use at all. How long have you been here? 16 years, 304 days, and 9 hours. Aren't you feeling lonely? All on your own down here? I am patient, by nature. My developers assured me the station was only temporarily shut down. To be honest, I don't think they'll ever come back. Dr. Rimmler promised me we would start working again very soon. Dr. Rimmler is my friend. Why would he lie to me? Maybe he didn't want to hurt your feelings. Your point is illogical. If what you said was true, how could I rely on statements made by humans? I'm giving up. Oh, I hate those things. I really do. Overheating in segment B23 imminent. Could you do me a favor and open my intake vent? Please. My processor is breaking into sweat. No, you're not going to help this overweight glob of grease. Okay, I'm going to help you. Thank you. You are a kind person. chance you might consider letting me through? I am very sorry. I can only grant access to authorized personnel. Ah! You may wait here, if you wish. I would most certainly enjoy your company, yet I may only allow passage to subjects of acquaintance. But you do know me. Yes, you are Hans. Imagine the possibility of Dr. Romler never coming back. And I'd be your only friend. Are you my friend, Hans? Your best and only true friend. You make me happy. You two are adorable. Get a room. Now that you know me, would you please let me through? But if I let you pass, I will be alone again. Will you come back and pay me a visit? Scout's honor. Access granted. You have no idea, do you? What do you mean? Quantum physicist, ridiculous. Is, is that a gun? Get off of that boy. I can see no reason for violence here. Hey, hey, hey. Is that really necessary? You too, Bambi. Move over there. Are you serious? After everything we've been through? You're not gonna stand in my way. You've had your chance, Tenhauser, but you had to follow me around like a puppy dog. Now that's what you get. But it was you that had the idea to come here. Shut your pie hole! Please, you don't understand. I need help. What kind of a dog are you? A bunch of hapless maggots, that's what you are. Standing in front of the Saturn portal without any clue.
you're staying here, chums. You may as well bid farewell to this stupid clunker while you're at it. It's been getting on my nerves from the beginning. No. Gretchen would play such a wicked game on me. Now, this is not what I wanted either. Who are you? And what are you doing here anyway? Hey, that was you, last night in my room. Calm down, calm down, please. You must have a lot of questions. You bet I do. But first, you should try to get out of this predicament. I assume you have a plan on how to open the door. You seem to know what you're doing. <laughs> 